Okay. So he's talking about maintenance. Was that a whole different thing? I forget. Right, let's go. Nowadays, one thing is not enough. You know what? Let's stomp this guy out. Got to make use of that stasis while I have it. needed node. We have been a bit low on them recently. I don't think there's going to come a time where I'd be able to spend that much money on nodes. I think I'll constantly need to replenish my health and my ammo. So I can't see myself having a whole bunch of money to just buy like five nodes. Okay, the comms relay crew. It happened again, third time in the last however long it's been. I came in after shift and found Russo at the transmitter again. They looked like hell. I don't know if they'd even slept since the last time I caught them in here. Not very assuring to see the chief engineer in that state. Russo didn't hear me come in, so this time I just listened. They were talking to the relay crew again. Talking, then listening. They even laughed. God, how long has it been since anyone on this fucking ship laughed? I know I should say something to engineering. I've already told Russo over and over that we don't have a comms relay crew. That, that array is broken beyond repair. That no one is coming to save us. And they listen, but it's like they can't keep those thoughts in their head. As if it's too much. I get it. Everything on the ship is too much. So this time, I just let them talk. If a broken transmitter and a mic full of static gives them something to hold on to, maybe even helps them keep the ship running a little longer, who am I to judge? And yeah, maybe I've talked to the same transmitter myself once or twice after hours. Just in case, like that poem says, hope sings a tune without the words, and it never stops at all. So we did just get a note. Make some improvements. We've only got one node. Thing. So I guess there's one more upgrade available. Kinesis throw damage. Yeah. Definitely need to try and get some more nodes here. That's another one of these situations. As you can see, those legs are just not coming off anymore. It's, it's harder. Oh, wow. It's one of these guys. Shit. Yeah, that's, that is not good. Maintenance locker. 
what could possibly go wrong in here? Nothing. Nice. Weapon upgrade. Let's go. Plasma cut upgrade. Wow. Okay. Doesn't tell me specifically what it is, but... I'll take that. Okay. Plasma cut getting some love again. That's good to see. How are we doing? Picked up some stasis packs. Oh, nice. Okay, now we're rolling. But what is this? Extend the upgrade path again. Okay, fine. It's just one of those. I think at this stage we have to buy... I'm going to sell some of these stasises. Stasis. I'm going to leave myself like one. I will buy another node. And what, this gets me another node anyway, so let's do that. Even though I'm not going to use it, it's still... Well, I might choose to later, who knows. So, let's have another look here. It's a good little shopping trip. Yeah, I think we're doing okay here. Let me go back to the bench. Where was it? It's here, right? So I should have a couple more nodes to work with. Well, three actually. Nice. I think I'm more likely to not use melee with it, let's be real. So we'll do that. Mm. Yeah, pul pulse rifle's been a bit ignored. It is what it is. This one, because I can't readily get um, like rounds for it, it just doesn't seem as good. Yeah, I'm going to go for that. Alright. Hmm? That's why. So, this again. Okay, they like their stasis packs at the moment. You can see what I mean though, the save stations are just so plentiful in this game, it's insane. But yeah, they're giving us a lot of supplies here. That's I'm sure there's a very good reason for that. Even more nodes. But we've already been upgrading a fair bit. I'll have a look at it on the way back, honestly. Wow. Okay, we're, we're heading for some, some stuff here. Well, that's more than I expected. So I'm so that I kind of take back what I said. I want to sell these like pulse round stuff. So I'll edit this out. Uh, I'll be, I'll skip ahead to the shop again. All right, we picked up a bunch of Stuff that we're not really going to use. I'll still leave one stasis pack in reserve. I think that's just a, a good idea. We still have a decent chunk of money here. Um, I'm going to sell one of the oxygens too. And honestly, I think I'm going to buy a medium med pack. I don't, I don't tend to buy them. But at the moment, I think it's a smart thing to do. The game's really gearing us up for something potentially significant. So... Okay. There we go. So really maximizing our resources here while I'm trying. I think that should help. Oh, 
All right, I'm ready to go. Error. Blast doors obstructed. Mm -hmm. Please contact a repair technician. I still can't reach the Valor. What's oh, happening with the antenna? Yeah. It's blocked by... It's the Leviathan. It must have snagged on the comms array after we spaced it. It's not coming off without a fight. Isaac, there's no time. There is if I use the ADS cannons. Manual targeting like before. I can shoot it right off the hull. I got this. You focus on the Valor. Will do. Yeah, that's fair enough. Fine. Yeah, having some other some kind of other cannon to fight it would be pretty fun. Because we've already had this boss battle basically. I'm not seeing the same, like, um, weak points as before. I guess you don't need to. Okay, I need the other cannon now. Whoa. Ah, I thought I avoided that. Okay. Let's go for it. Hey, I... That was nowhere near me. Get the hell out of here. Yeah, I kind of forgot to get some oxygen here. I remember where the oxygen was. Maybe you're supposed to do it in one go. I'm gonna die here. Yeah. I'm trying to think, I didn't even see it. Normally, they make the oxygens very easy to see. But maybe you're just supposed to be aggressive and just complete it all within one set of oxygen, but I don't know. I completely forgot I got too caught up in like targeting and evasion, all that stuff. Okay, no harm in refreshing that save. There's probably an auto one before anyway, but why not? If it saves me watching that cutscene again if I fail, then that's a good idea. Alright, here we go. Uh, okay, let's try. Oh god. So I assume there's no point in me firing anything, we just rely on these big cannons to do the job. Yeah. Okay, I think that worked. But where's the rest of the oxygen? ADS cannon destroyed. I might need to do it through here. Yeah. Son of a bitch, that's where the oxygen is, right? Okay. I was gonna say because there's just not enough time. Okay, perfect. So once again, trying to stay on the move. So far, at least seems easy enough again, just staying on the move. for me here, like I have to destroy every single one of these. Yeah, I don't have enough uh, resources to do that, surely. 
can I just... No. I'm taking my time here because I think I'll stay near the oxygen and try to do it from far. Whoa. I was going to say, maybe it's going to do a lot of the work for me. Try not to rush it too much. Stay close to my O2. Go low this time. I think there's more O2 on that side, actually. Possibly. Yeah, there's one, like, literally on the other side. So I'm going to get to the oxygen first. I'm not going to fire at anything yet. Actually, I will fire at this. Shit. That's fine. That's fine. We'll be okay. Okay, so we're back. Ah, screw you. There we go. Get my O2 back. Is it dead? Dead and gone. I'll try the antenna's manual release again. Do it. I've got a transmission loaded and ready to go. Whew. GG. Yeah, I guess I didn't have to uh, fire all of those things. I did waste some uh, ammunition in doing that, but it's fine. Not the end of the world. Don't need that. Exiting zero gravity. Yeah, I did use up a lot of contact energy there. Here we go. Yes! Finally! USM Valor, this is Kendra Daniels on the USG Ishimura. Do not open the escape pod. Repeat, <laughs> do not open that escape pod. Uh... Do you read? <laughs> Too late. Chen's running riot. Who are these guys? Not one of them could take down Chen. We're too late. The Valor! It's heading right for you! Brace yourself! Cold collision is There was nowhere to run anyway, so I just faced it head on. Okay. Are we still. I think we still just get out this way. Holy shit. We were so close. Daniels, what happened? Something shook the whole crew deck. What hit us? An asteroid? Something got onto the Valor. A rescue ship. They found your escape pod. And the one that used to be Chen is... God damn it! The Valor's scrapped. By the time another ship hears the SOS beacon, we'll all be dead. No, that's what I was telling you. I found an executive shuttle on the crew deck. Intact. And the log says that shuttle's missing a singularity core. It can't get us home. Wait. Maybe it can. If the Valor Singularity Core is okay, I could salvage it. Install it on that shuttle, we're fucking out of here. Where's the Valor now? It's near comms. Keep us stable. Isaac, I'll grab a suit and EVA onto the Valor. Meet me there. We'll find that core together. Let's see you see clean up their own mess. I'm saving what I can. Yeah, he's not losing anyone else. Oh, cool. Yeah, I was panicking for a second. I thought the oxygen had gone. I didn't realize uh, that we were still okay. <laughs> Yeah, this is cool. We get to venture out a little bit more. It's still not quite the the deep spacey vibes I truly want in this game. But this is definitely better. The more time I spend like out and a bit further away from the ship, the better for me. I'm just like deliberately just kind of exploring the boundaries a bit.
This is the kind of stuff I'm talking about. This vibe right here. That's super cool. But we know what happens when you venture too far, so I won't. Maybe in taking this direction, I've missed some equipment and stuff over there, but whatever. I'll survive. Isaac, I'm on board. The battler's trashed, but I can make it to the bridge. The hell was that? <laughs> what do you think? Exiting zero gravity. Exiting vacuum. Here we go. D O A. It's only one way through for now. It's not. This isn't the kind of thing I can really. Can I like shoot it and open it from here? That'd be funny. It's pretty cramped in here, so again, the Ripper, I think, is going to have to put in work. Whoa, that is still a bit creepy. Yeah, that's good stuff. Isaac, we have a problem. The Valor's carrying a 12 megaton warhead. The crash hit the torpedo bay hard. I need you to handle that nuke right away before something sets it off. Handle 12 megatons? You know I'm not a nuclear engineer, right? I don't need you to be. Just stabilize the warhead and eject it away from the Ishimura. Christ, Hammond. No one trained you to carve up monsters with a plasma cutter either. You haven't let us down yet. Yeah, like now suddenly he's like, no, this is too much for me. Everything I've done so far is well within normal parameters for me, but that? Nah. Hammond just gave him the... You're the main character, mate. Get on with it. I can see myself getting ambushed here. Lots of contact energy. I guess since you can't buy it, they're, they're giving you plenty. It's probably a sign that they want you to keep using it. Look at that. It's just... Unless those were force gun rounds. Let me double check. Ah, the force energy. Okay, fine. You know what? Let's swap them around again. Let's get the force guy... It is fun to use this one. It's just a nice, simple weapon. Just fire once and hopefully they die. That's it. There's no, like, hold this down or rotate anything. It's just good old-fashioned firepower. Oof. Yeah, it's very messy in here. Uh, what are you doing, mate? Are you okay? Let's say that guy is moving fast. Like if you got the runway, that's great. But if you don't, you're gonna be in trouble. It's another one of those where I probably have the to. Soldiers must have had stasis units on their armor. When they were turned, those units merged right into their bodies, <laughs> changed them. They're fucking fast, Isaac. Stay sharp. Shit, man. That is not good. That's the, the one thing that makes this game much harder. The less time you have, the more dangerous it gets. I think, again, that's why you need to stop them more quickly. Airlock. Yeah, 
Once again, it's a shame that the the flamethrower can't like stop them in their tracks. But still, in general, like the look and feel of this game is not lost on me. Like from the the first few minutes, in general, I just really dig the look of this game. It looks fantastic, and well, that's why it's a double-edged sword. That's why I do love playing it on PC. I think I'm sure the PS5 version also looks nice. It's not that it looks trash compared to this, but I think um, the PC version obviously is just going to give you that little bit extra that, for a game like this, can make a difference to your overall experience. I think. Let's listen to this audio log before we move on. This is Commander Cadigan to all hands. We have been boarded by hostile forces. Hostiles are alien. Repeat, alien and extremely dangerous. All personnel to arms. Fire at will. Right, so we've got another one here. Oh, I see. Okay, nice. We'll take that. Honestly, I should probably heal up a little bit. I'm just going to wait. <laughs> Something's eventually going to pop up here. Oh boy, of course. Right. Let's sort that out. Oh god. I kill everything. Obviously trying to use my own stasis to counteract the ridiculous speed. But yeah, everything just kind of went up a notch now. Like a significant notch. Yeah, already a bunch of false energy had to be used. And well, all the stasis is gone. Let me just check that I haven't missed a, a way to reload it here. Maybe that's why they gave me some of that stasis stuff earlier. <laughs> I was going to need it here, but I sold them all. That was smart. Mr. Clark? Hello? Ooh. I, I must speak with you. Who is this? Dr. Terrence Kine. Oh. The Ishimura's chief science officer. I, I studied the marker for the church. I'm done talking to unitologists. But, but the planet won't rest until the marker is returned. You, you can't leave. Watch me. Okay, that went well. Caution. Radiation hazard. Yeah, definitely need to keep the saves up here. So I think that was a bit earlier. Uh, well, probably like five, four or five hours ago now that I thought it was kind. We went into like a doctor's room and they had white hair and they were dead. Um... I thought it was kind after what happened with him and Matthias and stuff. Caution. But it wasn't. Radiation hazard. Torpedo bay. Caution. Right, we're getting our MGS on now. Having to disarm some nuclear warheads. Warhead unstable. Contain all explosive Right, we could have some uh, cat mousing around here. Yeah, like that. Go. No. Yeah. So, that's unlucky because, again, I pressed sprint to get away from it, but it blew itself up before I was able to, to leave. So, yeah, that's a bit lame, but that's fine. Yeah, I was literally going to say I'll probably do a lap or two um, 
see what enemies spawn and then deal with that. How do I stop him from doing that? I think it survived just slightly too long. Honestly, the Ripper worked pretty well for that last time. Basically just facing the Ripper onto its head slash body instead of that inflated explosive arm thing. It's not a tumor. I think that's what I'll go for this time. So a bit, a bit fiddly here. A bit of a delicate operation to, to do this. Let's sort this out. Probably going to be multiples of these guys. Yeah, it's funny because I've literally done that successfully like maybe six, seven times at least. Where I've used the Ripper and I've kept the arm intact. It's not a difficult thing. But now we're on a streak of just blowing ourselves up so we'll just keep doing that. Yeah, they knew you'd fuck up here. They literally placed the save outside the room as well. In case the auto save didn't work. Okay, I didn't spot this. This is a more like precision tool. There you go. That's what we needed. But I'm sure that's not going to be the only one. So they gave us a second one. Where's the other one? Where are you at? Okay. That's two. Pick that up. I did. Caution. Right. Warhead unstable. Contain all explosive materials. Okay. Crisis averted. Okay, the warhead's clear. Damn it, this doesn't add up. If the Valor was just on patrol, <laughs> yeah. why bring a nuke? And if they had a target, what's out here except us? Yeah, I know. I'm downloading a munitions report right now. I'll clear your route to the engine room. Grab that singularity core and let's get out of here. Yeah, well, it looks like there's a few of them here as well. I guess maybe these ones aren't nukes, but still. <laughs> 